So John and I met Thanksgiving night, 2016, and my brother and I were coming home from my sister. She lived in Clayton at the time. And I hit something in the middle of the road, and of course it popped my tire, so I pulled over. And my brother, he's like, no, 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 stay in the car, stay in the car. I'm trying to be like the man of the family, because it was just me and him. My dad was back in Clayton. So he's getting out, trying to change the flat, and I'm just sitting there. And of course, we see the trooper lights. So I was like, oh, thank God. Me and Brittany met on the shoulder of I-40 Thanksgiving night. 2016, um, I had sole and purpose of going to I-40 and sitting and doing absolutely nothing for an entire shift. And I saw two cars pulled over on the shoulder of the highway their hazard lights on. I checked on the first guy from the medium, and he hollered and said it was okay. And I went around, pulled up behind a little white Prius, and I saw this goofy looking little brown headed kid under the car, and I thought he was gonna kill himself. And standing beside him, was the single most beautiful one I've ever seen in my life. So he comes around, parks in the right lane to protect us or whatever. And so my brother's there working, working, and John's looking at me and is like, oh, where are you from? You know, what's your name? This and that, where'd you go to school? And we're just there like googly eyes, flirting, and my brother's like hammering away, like trying to change the flat. And um, so finally, he changes the flat or whatever, and John keeps saying, okay, I'm the only trooper working tonight. If you need any help, call this number. And he kept saying it 10, 20 times, and I was like, okay, like, I get it. Um, and then, so I never called the number, but I wrote into the Samson um, trooper patrol whatever, and I wrote an email saying trooper John Smith or whatever was really great and helped me and my brother this and that. And his sergeant actually gave me his name, which was John Smith, and I was like, okay. Um, but I Facebook stalked him and found him and I just like sent the request and then he messaged me the next day and we went on a date a week later and the rest is history. And as the minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I now pronounce them man and wife. You may now kiss the bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I introduce to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. John Franklin Smith. Thankfully, at some point, somebody made a comment on a trooper page, and she found out about it, and <laughs> somehow or another got in contact with me, and my life's been amazing ever since. Um, I couldn't thank her enough for being every, everything she's done. Brittany has truly brought me through the worst part of my life, the toughest part of my life, and I'm the happiest of everything now. And I know John Rett is happy to give me. And I absolutely love her more in the world. Everything was said, said and done and the tire was put back on. I got back in the car and I looked at Riley and I was like, <sighs> I said, I'm going to marry that man. John Smith.
Oh, 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 oh,